While on a short trip with friends to Branson, Missouri in June of 2023, I took a drive around Branson just to see what was going on and captured it all on video with my windshield mounted GoPro camera. In part one, we started our drive at the west end of the Branson Strip at the intersection of Shepherd of the Hills Expressway and 76 Country Boulevard and drove east the length of the Strip to the historic downtown Branson. After crossing Lake Tanicomo, we returned across the lake and concluded part one in front of the Branson Landing at the intersection with Main Street. In part two, we'll drive through downtown on Main Street, continue west on Highway 76, turn on Shepherd of the Hills Expressway and return to 76 via Gretna Road. As we turn on Main Street and cross the railroad tracks, we start up the hill through the heart of old downtown Branson. Here you will see stores, restaurants, ice cream shops, dessert places, and more. There is parking one block over behind the stores. This is a busy place. You may want to avoid parking along the street even if space becomes available, as it can be very difficult to get out due to the backup of traffic at the red light just up the street. After the intersection with Business Highway 65, we are back on Highway 76 Country Boulevard headed to the west. At the top of the hill, just before crossing the bridge over Highway 65, are several fast food chains, such as McDonald's, Steak and Shake, Wendy's, and Chick-fil-A. Heading back up the hill, the left lane takes you onto Highway 76 toward the Branson Strip. The right lane takes you onto the Blue Route, which will bypass part of the Strip. Be sure to check out the videos coming soon where I drive the alternate routes labeled as red, blue, and yellow that bypass traffic.
This area of 76 Country Boulevard has seen little development in recent years since the Branson Heights Shopping Center was virtually destroyed and then torn down in the Leap Day Tornado of 2012. Driving the strip from east to west gives a different perspective than the drive from west to east that we did earlier. As we cross Fall Creek Road, we will begin the drive on the unofficial strip headed west. This is also where we cross the yellow route. It's here I'm going to stop talking for a while as we enjoy the drive to the west on the Branson Strip.
As we near the end of the strip, we're going to turn onto Shepherd of the Hills Expressway, which is the end of the red route coming from downtown Branson. We'll drive down a portion of this. There are several theaters and other attractions on Shepherd of the Hills Expressway. On the left here, you see the IMAX Theater, home to the Peterson Show, along with other shops, hotels, and restaurants. To the left is the Shoji Tabuchi Theater, which was once one of the most popular places in town, but has not been in operation for several years now. To the right is the Pierce Arrow Theater, home to the Pierce Arrow Show, and then back to the left is the Hamner Theater, home to Hamner's unbelievable variety show as well as several other shows. Down this way is Brookside Miniature Golf, and also the Promised Land Zoo, which is a very popular attraction. Continuing on Shepherd of the Hills Expressway past the signal light would take us to the Sight and Sound Theater and eventually on the Red Route all the way back to downtown Branson. But that's for another video. We're going to turn right and jump over to the section of the Blue Route at Gretna Road and return back to the Branson Strip that way. Located on the right at the intersection with Gretna Road is the historic Majestic Steakhouse Theater, currently home to the Branson Wild West Murder Mystery Dinner Show. We'll turn right onto Gretna Road here and a portion of the West Blue Route. Located to the right at the intersection of Gretna and Wildwood Drive is Adventure Zip Lines, one of several zip lines located in Branson, Missouri.
If you haven't done so, would you take a minute to subscribe to our channel? It's free, and if you hit the notification bell, you'll be notified when we release new content, while at the same time helping us grow our channel. Gretna also takes us past Ballparks of America, which also has an entrance on the strip by Whitewater. The road in Blue Route winds itself up the hill and back to the intersection with the Highway 76 center strip area by the Titanic Museum, and then on the Highway 165 which eventually takes you out to Table Rock Lake. We'll turn back onto the strip and end the video here. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this uncut drive around Branson, Missouri. If you did, would you give us a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and leave us a comment to let us know if you like this type of video. We also have a condo in Branson that we rent out. If you're interested and would like more information, go to findushere.com slash Branson Condo. Also, if you'd like a list of shows and attractions, or would like to book tickets through our affiliate, go to findushere.com slash Branson. Meanwhile, check out this video next for more travel fun. And don't forget to subscribe.